Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Kevin and you're watching the Space Coast Bonsai. Today I'm bringing you a little burglary theft slash theft video. Um, this, this lady, I wouldn't even call her a lady. She's a piece of crap in my book. Um, she was extremely brazen and disgraceful and decided to steal 18 of my bonsai trees. Um, I live in a one bedroom apartment and over the past three years of getting into the hobby, I have acquired a lot of trees. And um, I have trees at three different properties. I probably had about 70 at my apartment about a month ago. And about two months ago, I started I started to get like one tree stolen at a time. Every couple days, I'd notice another one. I have a Brazilian rain tree stolen. I have a dwarf water jasmine stolen. Um, I actually. Whoever it is knows their plants because I purchased dwarf water jasmines. Um, they actually got shipped in from Maryland, a place called Meehan's Miniatures. It's like the only place that I could find that had them in the United States for sale, right? For pre-bonsai. So, um, both of those got stolen in about a two week span, one at a time. And I was not able to catch it on my ring. Um, not sure if they figured out the motion sensor month ago I had enough of losing you know a $50 tree here a $50 tree there so I took a total of um, I took about 20 trees to Melbourne where I work and then I took another 20 trees to my mother's house about 20 minutes away so actually there's three different properties now where I have a total of probably 130 trees and I only kept three trees at my house and this lady decided to steal 18 of them and like i said i think she has been she lives around the corner or something and she's been either coming and helping herself to one at a time and i think she realized like whoa you know because a week prior to her doing this um like i said i loaded up my trees 20 trees at a time and i took them to three different properties just to get them out of there because i couldn't um i couldn't stop you know the thieves and um so I have a ring video of her. Um, I got home from work, you know, it was like 6 p.m. It had just gotten dark, it was just getting dark. And I was actually on the phone, and you can kind of see my body language. I'm on the phone, and I start to look around like, where the hell are my trees at? And um, I was surprisingly calm. Last time, somebody stole just one tree from me. Once, if she wants to put them for sale, then she can get another dealing with stolen property charge. So that's prison time. That's like that's like if you go to the pawn shop, you steal something, you go to a pawn shop, you're doing prison time to get caught for that. So I'm really hoping this chick slips up and puts it for sale on Facebook or something because she needs to be in jail, man. People like that don't need to be walking the streets. Get a job, work, get a job. And you can buy whatever you want. You don't have to take from other people. I worked hard to accumulate. I, let's not even put a price tag on all 18 trees that got stolen, but let's put in the sentimental value to me. One of them being a tree that a gentleman from North Carolina gave to my son. He knows that's his tree and that tree got stolen, man. And that's just like, I can't even put a value on how much that tree is worth, you know? Sorry if I'm all over the place, guys. I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm just sickened by humanity that somebody could do this. You know, these are, it's just ridiculous, man. But I was able to look back at it and I was just so excited that finally my 400 something dollar investment in a ring spotlight cam, a ring doorbell, a solar panel, all that stuff finally paid off somewhat, right? So at least I have a suspect now the police have all the footage so hopefully they can um, hopefully we can get this lady you know
That's exactly what it is. I can tell. Every day I can tell. Yep. All right. Yes, of course. It's actually been two months since the trees were stolen and they have yet to find the culprit. But please be sure to subscribe to my main channel. It's KG Outdoor Solutions and I post on there way more than I post on here. Thanks, guys.